Daily Forex. This is Chris taking a look at the uh, dollar yen and Aussie dollar. And you can see dollar yen certainly has taken off to the upside uh, during the trading session. Pretty, pretty good sign um, that we are ready to really check out. This is a market that I think will continue to see um, a bit of a uh, push towards the 110 level. If that does, in fact, get uh, broken, then I think it's a longer-term buying opportunity. That being said, uh, I do believe that the market at that point probably goes to fill the gap and then to the 112 level after that, 112.50. Uh, pullbacks continue to be supported. Um, you know, it's been chipping away at this for a while, so I like buying dips. Aussie dollar, this one's going to put you to sleep. It's a market that really has nowhere to be, and that's probably going to be the case as long as we have this stuff going on between the United States and China. So I don't like the idea of uh, trading this pair at all, really. But once we get some type of impulsive candlestick, maybe even on the um, weekly chart, then I think you might have a longer term play just waiting to happen. Uh, that's because it will be a clear uh, turn around to the upside. Now, if we break down below this area here, we get a 67, 67 being broken would of course be a very negative, um, sign, perhaps going down to, uh, the 65 level. That's a longer term, uh, call though. That would be more of a grind fest. Now, I think at this point though, if we turn around and break out to the upside and we get some type of major, um, impulsive weekly candlestick that could be your trend change now unfortunately uh it does not happen i think without some type of major movement in the uh, u.s china situation mm -hmm.